Hey, good morning. How are you today? Um, it's a pretty sunny day, as you can see there. The Elsie's sitting in the sun, so we've got a bit of sun today. So lucky Elsie. So um, I've been working on uh, diorama stuff. This is for Rim's models. So Robert Rimmer. Um, I've built it for him, and I'm going to send it to him. And I'm be interested to see what how he approaches it. And so this is his brick wall, and and I'll show you his other part, hold on. And this is his base here. So I've got a fair bit of it done. I was set up last night doing it, so I got it nearly completed. So I've got some mortar holes, so mortar rounds of hit. And I've got a compass. So you got north, east, south and west. And um, I'm just making a slightly different change in the direction of the road here. Uh, the brick wall will be able to be installed there. So I'll make a, a, a slot for it there. And then behind that, I'll put some, you know, wooden, uh, wooden flooring. And then Rob can do what he likes with it. He can smash it up and put bricks on it and do all kinds of things, paint it up and do whatever. So I've got to do another footpath, a footpath this will be left clear so Rob can, um, you know, put in whatever he likes, just debris. He could put in a telegraph pole or he can do whatever he likes there. And, um, yeah, it's going to be looking cool. So that'll stay in once it's, there'll be a slot. You see, I'm making a slot for it. And that'll just go in there and then there'll be a brick wall that'll, I mean, a uh, wooden wall that'll come in, a wooden floor wall that'll come in behind here and that will just butt in nicely along there and that'll hold uh, put that in so it'll just fit in like that but i'll send it as two separate pieces because you can't really mail it like that you have to mail it like that or something so that's how that's going and uh but i'm gonna have a break because i worked on it all night last night um so today i'm just going to do some black pin washing on the um t54 uh, now I'm doing the back here as you can slow so just black pin washing up the back parts here and very slowly so just cleaning up with white spirit or mineral turpentine as we call it in Australia you see we have different terminology in different parts of the world and this is where a lot of people have gotten mistaken in Australia we call white spirit mineral terps but we can in Australia we we sometimes call all white spirits white spirits so um don't take what i say exactly before asking what i mean by it you know what i mean so i do try and say white spirit and all that kind of stuff the sort of more international sayings but in australia we really do say things a lot differently so um i don't know why we're just a weird little nation i suppose because we're an island But yeah, I'll get that done. Also, I'm going to do some work on this rust. I've got some ideas. Um, so I'm going to try something with that. I'll let you know how it go. And yeah, just slowly, slowly, I'm going to take my time with this one because uh, I really like it a lot. And um, yeah, just take my time and we'll get it done right. And um, hopefully it comes out really nice, like a really good tank. Uh, I've got some wash for that wooden a uh, piece of wood, I'm sorry. So I just dry brushed that piece of wood with deck tan after I um, painted it, the whole thing. So it's got the green on it and I heavily dry brushed it. So it, it, you can still see the green in it. So it, it looks like it's been painted, but most of the paints come off. And that's how that's coming along. So yeah, I'll keep going with that. Just giving you a bit of an update to see what's going on. And um, Robert, your base will be ready soon. So, all right, I'll see you guys soon. 